that has been pretty much the narrative for the entire yeah. week. Rain, thunderstorms, some of those severe. Right now we've got downpours moving over top of the metro, northern Kentucky as well. In fact, that heavy rainfall coming in right now over top of downtown Cincinnati. So what we're looking at are some very quick moving storms. In fact, these are moving at about 50 miles per hour, generally to the east. So right now that heavy rainfall impacting the east side, I-71 from Blue Ash down to Madeira, Marymount, Newtown, and then over toward Turpin as well. We've also got that heavy rainfall extending back toward Wyoming. Thunder and lightning too. Some briefly gusty winds definitely associated with this as well. Golf Manor, this is not fun to drive in. If you know anybody who's driving right now along any of the interstates, this is going to be one of those situations where you'll have to slow down, make sure those windshield wipers are on probably high and it's just going to be a little bit difficult to drive over the next little bit. But the good news I can tell you is that these are moving fairly quickly, so I don't expect this to be something that we're dealing with for very long. Right now over top of Marymount Newtown, that heavy rainfall impacting areas over toward Terrace Park and Milford. This going to move into Day Heights, Goshen. Your sky is probably already gray and it's probably already raining at a pretty good rate right now too. Sims Township, Loveland, it's already starting to lighten up for you though. And then down toward Pendleton, Eden Park, OTR, downtown Cincinnati. We're starting to see that rain getting a little bit heavier. Much of the same for Covington, down toward Fort Mitchell, Park Hills, uh, areas around Villa Hills as well, Crescent Park, and then Crestview Hills too. Seeing some fairly heavy rain. And it's only going to get heavier for a little bit. Not going to last forever, but still looking at that heavy rainfall. Claremont County in Newtonsville. You are up next for seeing this heavy rain. Goshen is seeing it right now. Thunder and lightning and then Stone Lick, Batavia, Amelia. You'll start to see that rain moving in fairly soon as well. In addition to that, we have some other downpours over top of Clinton County right around New Vienna and Martinsville, Hillsborough too. Into northern Kentucky, we also have some downpours that are starting to develop along I-75 here from Crittenden down to Dry Ridge and then even some parts of Owen County as well, seeing some of that rainfall rolling through there. I threw on a rough estimate of these storms and when they're going to start to move into areas to the east. So they'll start to move into, say, uh, areas around East Batavia, closer to about 721 or so. So just within the next couple of minutes, handful of minutes before it starts to move into Stone Lick as well. And then areas around uh, Springtown, 723 for you. So this is all moving off to the east and eventually we'll start to see the rain lightening up a little bit. Good news is I think as we get to about eight o'clock or so, most communities are going to start to dry out. Look at the difference of this view. Just in the last five to seven minutes, we were able to see across the river into northern Kentucky. Now you can barely even make out the Ohio River here, even the Red Stadium right there. Really difficult to see. So this is some really heavy rain, but it's all sub severe. As we go through the rest of tonight, downpours and lightning for the next little bit. This upcoming weekend, showers is what you can expect, mostly for Saturday though. We'll be dry on Friday, dry on Sunday too. So we just have some rain in between there on Saturday. These showers come to an end here fairly soon and then overnight we are going to dry out tomorrow morning, waking up with clouds. Mostly cloudy skies sticking around for a portion of the day tomorrow. 63, that's it for that high temperature. This is a cold front moving through, so it is cooler tomorrow as a result. Then by Saturday, scattered showers drying out by Sunday for Mother's Day. Guys.